And it's not a huge drop in shares of Tesla today. And for the most part, most people are saying, okay, we're pretty much back to where we were on August 7th. As for why Tesla will remain public as opposed to pursuing the option of going private, Elon Musk says that while he had an opportunity to fill this whole process out, he said, although a majority of the shareholders I spoke to said they would remain with Tesla if we went private, the sentiment in a nutshell was, please don't do this. There are a couple of factors behind why Tesla probably didn't go, uh, was not going to pursue going public. First of all, even though Musk maintains they could have had the financing, he could have put a deal together, it was going to be tough. Probably would have involved other automakers being interested in taking a stake in Tesla. A couple of reports out today saying Musk had no interest in allowing somebody like Volkswagen to take a stake in the company. Small investors, by the way, they might have not have been able to go along with the idea or with the investment of going public. And as a result, Musk was saying, look, I like those small investors. I want them to be part of the company. Overall, guys, this was going to be tough to make happen. And ultimately, Musk and the board said, no, we're not going to do that. By the way, Barclays out with a note today saying this entire 20 day process, this flirtation with going private now raises cracks in the credibility of both Musk and Tesla. They are maintaining their price target at just over $200 a share. And again, the stock down just under 2% today, not a huge reaction. The focus now turns to profitability in the third quarter. Can that be achieved?